Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing, um, I guess my make my um, new makeup look. I'm going to uh, be running some errands, and then I'm going to be going to the gym, and I'm gonna be meeting uh, one of my friends up uh, this morning for coffee. So I don't want to have too much makeup on. Um, so this is pretty much the makeup look that I I do when I'm in a hurry, and but I still want to look put together. If you want to see how I create this um, makeup no makeup look, uh, keep on watching. So the first thing that I did uh, when I woke up this morning was do my moisturizer. And then I went ahead and did, uh, sorry, <laughs> I went ahead and did this lamp calm um, right under my eyes. I feel like I'm ready now because I have very little left. I've been having it for a while, but it seems like, I, I mean, every time I, I press it, a uh, product still comes out. So this, th these two uh, lamp calm products have lasted me forever. I keep on thinking, oh my God, I'm gonna be done with it this week and I still have quite a bit left. So like right now, I probably will still have enough for the rest of the week. Okay, so, so I'm applying, so I'm applying this Clinique um, foundation and concealer all over my, my face, especially in the areas that I want coverage. And then I'm just gonna use my finger and just go right at it and blend it out. And I find that this method helps the most for me. It, I don't know if it warms, I think it just warms up the product so it blends a lot better. And I'm gonna be adding another layer. And this is gonna be my concealer and my uh, foundation. I'm not gonna do anything else to, uh, for coverage. I'm just going to seal it with a, a translucent powder. So I'm gonna keep on blending. Um, and I'm probably gonna fast forward through all of this because I do a lot of blending. And I don't want to bore you. Okay, so next I'm going to be sealing uh, the foundation with this uh, mineral makeup from uh, Physician Formula. And this is a mineral makeup and it's in the color medium beige. And I'm using a pretty big, a thick brush so I can get more product on. And I'm gonna apply it directly to my face. And then I'm going to uh, put a little bit more and then I'm going to pinch it. And then I'm gonna be putting it over my eyelashes. I mean, I'm sorry, my I would be put it, applying it as I, I would apply um, a little bit of eyeshadow. So I'm just gonna go like that right on my eye. See, just to kind of bring me some color in there. So I'm using the same brush, I'm just pinching it a little bit. And now I'm just gonna kind of blend it down. I don't wanna apply too much makeup on my neck because I am gonna be sweating later. I'll um, be going to the gym, so I don't want to have all that makeup um, all over my clothes. But I do want to look kind of put together right now when I go to the coffee shop. So this is pretty much what I'm just uh, just doing. Okay, so once I blend everything nicely, I'm going to do my eyebrows. Kind of brush them up. And next, I'm going to be doing a... Um, I'm going to be using this clear um, mascara. I'm going to be using it on my eyebrows. And I just want them to kind of like stay in place. My eyebrows tend to uh, like face down or just be all over the place. So they make them look all crooked. So I kind of just want them to look like they're combed um, and somewhat symmetrical. Okay, and then now I'm going to be adding um, some bronzer. And I'm gonna be using this like a like a contour type. Um, so I'm just using a uh, an elf uh, blush brush, but I'm gonna be using it as a contour. I'm just gonna kind of contour, and then I'm gonna use whatever product is left in there, and I'm gonna just kind of run it through my nose. And then now I'm gonna go back and add mascara. And then I have this mascara that has two, that it has a primer and then the, the um, I guess the black mascara. So I'm gonna start off with the white one. It's from Lancome. Um, but I also have another one that's from Wet n Wild and I like them both um, almost uh, the same. Okay, so I applied uh, the primer. Now I'm gonna go back in there and apply the black. So I did it on my um, top lash. Now I'm gonna do it at the bottom lash. Okay, so I have mascara on now. And now I'm gonna go back in and uh, apply a little bit of blush. And I'm gonna be doing this Wet n Wild um, 
it's called a uh, catwalk pink in the number 320 so but a lot of times i use uh the illuminators as a uh, eyeshadow and so what i'm doing now i'm just gonna add some lipstick and i'm gonna be using this um it's called nude thrill and it's in the number 755 and i think it's by covergirl i'm not sure and so it's pretty nude i'm also going to be adding gloss over it and this is from wet and wild and this is pretty much it now i'm just going to uh fix my hair a little bit more and that'll be done and then last i'm going to be adding the uh, setting spray and i'm adding a lot of setting spray just because i want it to last a little longer and that's pretty much it i'm done um so yeah maybe you like it thank you for watching